I just told you a little story now. I just need a bitty boy. I tell you all. We got some crawfish down on the bayou. Hurrying on down a lonely road because there's a storm coming in the distance. Storm black cloud hanging down. Dark. Black. When out of that black come a Model T4 making no sound at all. The car pulled up beside me there and a man inside. Pale face. Top hat. He looked down at me, he say, uh, what you doing out here, boy? All by yourself. I hold up them crawfish there to show him. All by yourself, he say. I gotta get home, I say. I don't like him some, so I start to head off. Why, where you going, he say. My ma waiting for me, my tree sister. Come around here, boy, I wanna show you something. I gotta get home, I said. Come round here, boy. I wanna show you something. So I swallow up a bit there. I walk around the passenger side of that there car. I get up on the running board. I look down in the window. And what do I see? A fish. Dry sand flopping around, gills going. <laughs> Where you get that fish, mister? That Pacific Ocean, he say. That there's a devil fish. You know what Pacific mean? It's an ocean, I say. Pacific mean peace. And then he take his long white finger and he lay them down on that there fish. And the fish go still. Peace, he said. Yeah. Now I'm gonna tell you something, boy. You listen real good. You ever want or need a devil fish from an ocean of peace, you just call on me. And then he whistled a little melody, like so. Down there to them there crossroad. Mr. Graham? Jedediah Jeremiah Graham? Yeah, who be you then? I am Mycroft Coney. I'm the attorney. I have the We really should go to the crossroads. I had myself an expectation the man himself would be here. These are um, ancient forms and procedures, and although they may seem quaint, I assure you they are not, believe it or not, binding unless they are signed at the crossroads. If you look on page 15, I apologize for the length, but these things must be done right. It clearly states that the crossroads, or a crossroads, as specified in section D, must be the location- Your pages are all white as snow, boy. Well, only just. Who are you? Are you looking for Jedediah Graham? Jedediah Jeremiah Graham?
sign there, Conrad. The mother were a midwife. I had three younger sisters. Papa, you were in the merchant marine. I'm gonna never come home. I brought myself back that day. I'm catching crawfish. There was a single knife in my mother's truck. And one in each of my sister. The wind was blowing against the house. Storm. I heard a melody. Not a lot much more important than the man who write up the contract, did that? So what he give you now? What? For your mortal soul there, what'd he give you? Nothing. Well, you must ask for some. Money. Power. Sex. I didn't sell my soul. Billable hours, that's how I get paid. Just like any other job. Billable hours. I, uh, I write the contracts. I, I get them signed. I, I, I record it. Uh, a travel time. I don't like that sum none at all, Annie. It's only a job. You think you can write up the contract for him? Walk them out to that there crossroad for him. Get those poor wayward boys to sign away their everlasting soul for him on that there daughter line? I know how this works. I didn't sign anything. I didn't sign no contract before again, neither. Who do you think own my soul? I'm going to hell in a bobsled, boy. It's a song you sing, Mr. Conan. God's contract is written on the face of your life. It don't fit no briefcase. No mother, no father to speak of. I done grow myself up. Catfish and crawfish and bluefish and rat and possum. And I done brought myself from one end of this world to the other. I was looking and I whistled that tune. Over and over I whistled that tune so I could stab him to the throat. But he never come, coward. And someday they will write them books. They will sing them songs. They will put up them statues to the sky for the man what killed the devil. <laughs> Think in your head, God's voice. What do you think he'd say to you? Well, given what you've done, how you've done it, who you've done it with, how you sold yourself and for nothing but a fee. You could have had a mountain of gold. You could have had a harem with a thousand female ladies for all your days. You think God will protect you now? You're gonna tell me everything you know, everywhere you've been, everything you've seen. I don't know what you want. You know just what I want. You know who I work for? No, he don't need you to protect him. I can't. You walk all the way to them there crossroad? Huh? I hear you coming for a mile. Tromp, tromp, tromp. 
I mean, the weather is fine, but why are you walking? Um, w well, it's, it's part of the deal. How many times have you done this? I don't know. I guarantee you met some interesting people, folk. Your line of work. I mean, the folk are willing to throw eternity on the fire to keep warm for the night. Well, I don't get to know them. It's not personal. It's not personal? That's all it is, huh? It's more personal than your meat and potato liver. How many human souls you bought, boy? You promised them what? You let them know they're gonna burn? How many, huh? How many you did? Are you lecturing me on morality? Whose blood do you have all over you? A bit of yours. A bit of Jedi diagrams. I saved his soul. I could save yours. You're insane. Mr. Coney, I'm gonna beat you plumb most all the way to death. You don't start talking. And now I'm gonna make John lie out of your fingertips. I have no idea how I got here. His address. Is that where you get the contract? What happened? I called his number here. Untie me. Pray your master. Hurry, though. I'll be knocking on his door as soon as soon can be. You are as blind and dumb as a pillar of salt. Louis Chassour. You know my name. You are an ant fighting a forest fire. You have no idea what kind of suffering awaits you in this life. 